When you're in the hospital, you're exposed more than ever to dangerous bacteria, which is why hospital cleanliness is a must. Joining us now with a new product that will help keep medical facilities sparkling is Dr. Aharon Gedkin, the co-founder of Nanotextile. Thank you so much for coming in. Thank you for interviewing. All right, so, so tell us a little bit about what Nanotextile does. What product have you created? Nanotextile is a company that was formulated, uh, founded on 2015, following a uh, uh, European community project that I was coordinating. And in this project, <clears throat> we have developing a coating technique that coats textile in such a way with nanoparticles that are killing bacteria. Therefore, if in the hospital, the bed sheets, the pillow covers, the pajamas, everything will be antibacterial, the number of people that will die will be reduced tremendously. Right, so this has the potential to save many, many lives, and I'm imagining there are people who want clothes made out of this uh, or coated with this Absolutely. material, right? Yeah. Okay, very cool. So um, what is the cost uh, of, of these types of textiles? Well, uh, it's very cheap. There is no other companies that can compete with the price of nanotextile in producing these coated fabrics, which are very special because the coating technique is very special, and the outcome, the results are such that the fabric that was coated was washed 65 times in hospital washing machine. That's not the washing machine in your house that yeah. works at 30 or 40. It works at 92 degrees centigrade, and after these 65 washing cycles, the material, the antibacterial coating was still on the fabric. That's, that's incredible. All right, so I understand that um, this was scaled up during a $12 million euro R&D project, right? Uh, what was tested during that project? Well, first of all, the washing. Secondly, it was placed in a hospital. The coated fabrics, coated cotton, for example, yeah. and 22 patients were dressed with pajamas that were antibacterial, were sleeping on bed sheets, with pillow covers, everything was coated. And in parallel, there were 17 or 18 patients that slept on regular beds. And the outcome was such that there was a, a distinct difference between the two populations. Beautiful. Less contaminated with bacteria were the people that slept on our uh, Fabrics. Interesting. Well, I, I can already imagine so many different ways we can use this, right? In restaurants, public spaces, beyond Absolutely, just hospitals. Yeah. So congratulations. Thank you for joining us.